welcome back to my channel. Killian's got a nice smile for you this morning too. It's Sunday morning and we are having some breakfast. Hi! Actually, I just finished eating and Killian ate and we're playing, but um, Nolan needs some breakfast so I'm making him some waffles. So we have a very busy morning this morning. We need to bring the dogs to the vet. Um, I was uh, lapsed in, um, I don't know, maybe it's more like I was remiss <laughs> in bringing them to get their rabies vaccination and now I've realized their rabies vax is overdue by like a month. <laughs> so we are rushing to get over to the vet. We're just going to a vetco. So the pet codes in our area have something called vetco and they have like vet clinics and you can go and you can actually get like the rabies vaccines and some of the other shots and stuff are like way less than at your regular vet. So the dogs are definitely overdue for their wellness check, but I just want to get their rabies shot done. Um, that way I can give that paperwork to our town and be in compliance as well. So I kind of ran into a conundrum here. So I had to rearrange my morning schedule and we're going to bring them over to the VECO, um, which is about half an hour, 35 minutes away and um, get their rabies shots and then we can go to um, the rest of our day. So the rest of my day is pretty much, um, I have the morning at home and then I'll be um, teaching yoga in the afternoon. So I have a one o'clock and a 4.30 that I'm teaching um, and I'm going to attend a class. Um, the studio that I am teaching us about a half an hour from my house. So I am going to be teaching um, and then taking a class and then teaching again because it doesn't make sense to come home because I'll be home for like maybe an hour, maybe, I don't know, uh, not even an hour, like half an hour. <clears throat> so anyway, I'm just kind of doing that today. So that's pretty much my day. So that, hopefully a little bit of time to change and have lunch and then it's teaching yoga class, teaching, dinner in the evening and then, then the week is over so you may see my hair's a little wet here but I have my hair cut I had my hair cut yesterday it's so sure I love it but do you remember it was like up to here um so I had my hair cut and colored I don't know if you can see that it's like a lot more blonde um it's also still pretty wet here and I never have my hair down and, and ever but um especially my vlog so you get to see it a little bit with my hair down what I do after I get my hair colored is I do not wash my hair for like three days. Um, the color I've noticed continues to process in my hair for up to three days. Um, so it gets like blonder and just like a better color if I don't wash it for that time. But check it out. It's pretty light. It looks good. I'm excited about it. But anyway, I'll take you along with our vet appointment. I'm hoping the dogs are okay. Um, they don't, they're not very well socialized, so they don't do really well in these environments, and that makes me so super n nervous. Um, so I'm hoping that they do well. Like, they'll be okay in the car, because we'll put the crates in the car, and they'll have that sense of safety. Um, oops, Killian. Everything okay, Killian? What do you want? You need that one? Do you, you want to open it? Give it to me. I can open it. Can for you? Good. You made it out. Go check on. We can go check on um, Nolan's breakfast. He's been playing a ton of Fortnite lately and he plays with his friends online. Um, so we can play in the living room on, on our TV, which is kind of nice because we get a nice good view of what he's doing on there. Um, and we've been setting up some very clear and distinct boundaries of his play. I uh, don't know that he's very happy about that, but he is doing really well with it. So he's earning, um, we're using a positive reinforcement tool. So each time he transitions well, and then we just discuss each time he has a good day at school. So I get a chart at his school that says like, um, like 
oh, great day, okay day, and then not my best day or something. And if he gets a great day or an okay day, he's also getting a star starting next week. So he has a few stars for last week. It was a transition week into this new program, um, positive reinforcement program that we're doing. And um, he has an opportunity to get a couple of stars today as well to finish up his week with stars. So each star equals $1 and um, he can trade in the dollar for like an experience so he can trade in his money to go get an ice cream with us or to go for a bike ride with us or to get V bucks on Fortnite, which is probably the focus um, he's interested in getting a couple of things on his Fortnite account I guess they can trade their V bucks in for different kind of costuming and stuff like that and he's interested in that um, so he um, is at a position now where he can um, add up his V-Bucks, or add up his stars, get V-Bucks, and um, maybe get something he wants that comes up. So that's what he's working on. And um, he's doing really well. And um, I don't know that he necessarily likes it because it's definitely a huge change from what we've been doing in the past. But you know, um, he typically has a difficult time with transition. Um, and we know that, so going forward we know what we know what we're we're get, heading into anyway so my husband is mowing the lawn um and i'm gonna finish up the breakfast and then we'll head out it's okay to go around so calm down i bring up no 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 you go stay in here stay in here stay in here the dogs are really worried because their crates are leaving we're getting them ready to go to the car. This is why the vet stinks. They get so distressed about any change. So they're really worried about what's happening right now. The security is being like thrown out the door. So we got the dogs, rabies shots done. So they're all set, that's really good. They did a wonderful job and Nolan did an awesome job helping um, with the dogs too. So it was uh, really like, it went pretty smoothly. Um, so we were in there for like maybe 20 minutes. 15-20 minutes or so, so that was like very nice and smooth and, um, and good. So we're heading back home and um, we get some things to eat and stuff like that. <laughs> Look at all the food in your hair. Woo! Are you okay? My gosh, boy, you are wild. <laughs> oh my god. All right. All right. No, 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 we're not gonna start playing with food, okay? Come on. <laughs> so, Chris, I couldn't resist this. Um, I couldn't resist this. Um, caramelized onion and butter. I don't think you're in the shot. I'm not in the shot. This is Mazetta's caramelized onion and butter. Usually retails for about $6.99 or $7.99. It was on sale for $3.99, so I got it. Um, I couldn't resist it, but I did get one without dairy for Killian because apparently despite the fact that the doctor ran the test on his blood and he doesn't have a milk protein allergy, he seems to be reacting to milk products again. So yogurt seems to be okay, but any cheeses are not working out. So anyway, this little guy seems okay now though. <laughs> Meanwhile. Let's see what the other dude's up to. Let's see what he's up to in his, in his natural environment. I see someone. I'm gonna sneak up and then. Oh, I knocked someone! Meanwhile, I like the rocket launchers because close range, they're kind of good. <laughs> you just shoot it on the ground. Oh, there he is. They're dead. 
Oh, I thought he was gonna throw it at you. It's all blurry. I have it on a different setting now, so it gets like. Well, do you want to comb your hair? Yeah. Okay. What? Oh, is that nice? He's like, actually, I'm playing ball here. I love ball. Anyway, um, so this afternoon I um, had um, a one o'clock class that I taught and then I took a class at 2.30. Because I had to teach again at 4.30, it just made sense. It was like um, the location of the studio is like half an hour away. Um, but then my 4.30 class, I didn't have anybody show up. So, I mean, I should have known. It was like, it's 4.30 on a Sunday and it's a beautiful day out. Um, so I, uh, boop, I tailed it out of there and um, came home, which meant I was able to go food shopping, which is good, because I thought I'd have to go after Killian went to bed, and then we had a nice dinner, so yeah, I just had to tell you about that, because obviously you didn't get to see it, but anyway, so that's our day. I mean, it's just what it is. It's a beautiful Sunday, a lot of fun. Um, Nolan has been playing Fortnite and, and doing really well in Fortnite, which is awesome, and he also yeah. was able to, um, uh, spent some time with friends again today. So they came by on their bikes and invited him off and about. So he went off and about with them and I think that's great. So we got some time outside too. So yeah. that's good. You need a gun? Meanwhile, I got this guy creeping up on me. I well, I did it. have him creeping up on me. <laughs> is that Russell? Yeah. Russell loves to sit there while <laughs> balls are being flown around. Like, Ew. around him. I don't know. Ready? Ew. Woo! There he goes. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> it's like the way he burns off energy before bed. We have a tubby tonight, too, you know. Good thing. That hair needs to get cleaned up. Oh, this hair is fine. It's spiky. Just has some pizza crust in it. Just some pizza, pizza crust, no problem here. Be nice to to uh, wrestle now, Killian. Hello, I am back. Killian is in bed and no one's heading to bed. And it seems like our new system of, of like saying it's time to go up and going up and rewarding um, rewarding Nolan for going up. So now he earns, um, and forgive me if I already said this to you guys but he earns stars for everything um, that he does that's good so if he goes upstairs without a fight um, to go to bed if he um, shuts off the TV and leaves to go somewhere he gets a star so he can get upwards of like a few stars in a day but average is about between two and four stars a day and um, so he's getting close he's as of this whole week as long as he doesn't give um, Chris too much of a fuss upstairs now, he has eight stars for the week, which I think is pretty good. So he can, like I said, he can earn two to four a day, um, generally about two. Um, so I think eight is a really good start and he's doing awesome. So he, each star is equal to a dollar um, and he can trade that in for what I call an experience, like a time with us um, doing something. Um, like getting an ice cream or something like that or he can um, I guess it also constitute an experience but is um, he can trade it in for V bucks and that's on that game um, oh my god why can I I always want to say frontline but it's not frontline um, I think I'm gonna have to like scroll it because I can't remember what it's called anyway the game he's playing he gets V bucks and um, it's actual money you can put online on the system and then it translates into what they call V-Bucks to get certain things or skins or whatever that you want to get on the game. So he can trade in his points for dollars, which will be dollars in you know V-Bucks. So anyway, um, that seems to be working pretty well. So I hope you can keep it up and we can keep it up and it will just help so much with behavior. 
in our household and makes for a really like this weekend was way nicer than last week the last couple weekends so i hope we can keep up this good trend and um so i'm going to be working on the vlog right now see my computer is getting ready actually i should be booting it up it's getting ready to happen here and this is where the magic happens people it's also where dinner happens and breakfast because my office is, I think I've told you it's off of Killian's room. So, And I am soaking my feet because my feet are so tired. So here they are. Wait, can you see? No, you can't. Hold on. Here they are. Soaking, soaking away because they are dog tired. They're just like, I've been on my feet a lot, picking up Killian and then working. Um... So, feet are tired. Anyway, so have a good night. I will see you this week. I don't know if I'll have a vlog up later this week, but if not, it will be next week. So, thank you so, so much for visiting my channel. Good night and have an awesome week. Namaste. Namaste.